move on to our next trailer, Roma. Um, Roma. Please. Yes, which I think is a... <laughs> Sorry, I made it awkward. <laughs> which I think is an all uh, Spanish film. Ooh. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. Okay. <coughs> Very Caesar. cool. I like foreign films. Okay. Wow. Wow. Yeah, he's great. Got you. Powerful trailer. Yeah, no yeah. kidding. Um, it reminded me of the trailer. And, um, so is it theatrical and Netflix, or is it just Netflix? I think it's just Netflix. Uh, I, missed that, I missed that last it one. It says it, it premiered at Venice Film Festival, but um, you know what? I'm almost positive it's going to be Netflix, because when's the last time you heard of a Netflix mm -hmm. releasing anything in theaters? Mm -hmm. Right? True. They don't do that. Well, it's not, it's not a, is it, is it, is it a Netflix production? Maybe they just bought it. That well, that's a great question, actually. Uh, looks like release. It was announced that Netflix has acquired the distribution rights. Oh, okay. okay. So he there made it. He mm -hmm. went because uh, I was like, Alfonso Cuarón's got his own like little like production. Oh, okay. Yeah. So okay. I, I, that's why I wondered if it was his his little shingle or if he like went through Netflix. And gotcha. Yeah. I, it looks like right. And actually, most Netflix originals don't don't premiere at they, festivals they don't yeah they don't yeah. do any of that yeah. so. well and they're not even allowed in some anymore right oh man that sucks um for like uh That's yeah stupid. it's for really stupid, stupid. Reasons, yeah <laughs> they should be can, um, can you like just go down a little bit and sure just, um plot. read the um uh, the plot the i film plot. chronicles a year in the life of a middle class family in mexico city in the early 70s oh wow, wow. very simple very wow. straightforward but it's there's a, so much it looks like a lot of slices of life a lot of like day in the life it looks gorgeous i mean for for being black and white it looks amazing it reminded me of the trailer that we watched recently from the guy that directed moonlight i don't remember yes. what the trailer was called oh if, if beale street could talk so or yeah beale, yeah beale street something, something yeah. Like yeah. That. yeah yeah um so pretty very yeah. similar in style with the music yes. and the um the cuts yep um although the other one had color and there was there was some talking right it, it reminded me of it yeah um i really like films like this i think there was yeah. a movie that came out last year called the florida project which was um big in the indie circuits um and it was really well done and it was similar to this in that it was a slice of life um i guess you could call it um and it was focused on um what it's like to live in uh, a motel essentially um just outside of the best place in in the world uh or, or the, the happiest world. place in the world disney world nice. um and it's so it's about like kind of impoverishment in that area and it was very cool. powerful um and that seems like we're going to see things like that here too right uh, plus alfonso Cuarón is, is like that's like his bread and butter mm -hmm. <laughs> what else what else has he done oh uh a two mama tambien uh, okay he oh yeah harry potter oh yeah the one of the best uh, ones no, it's a different guy. Gravity. Oh, uh, Children of Men. Yeah, Children of Men. I should mention is one of my favorite films yes. of all time. Yeah. Gravity is really perfect. good. Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban is one of my favorite Harry Potter oh, movies. I think sure. it's wonderful. Yeah. Someone with Gary Gary Oldman. I never watched Parisia Ten. They I heard they kind of remade that. Oh um, yeah. For what? like there's a 
there's like a Japanese there's version a Tokyo. of it. Tokyo. Oh. Tokyo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ooh, and he dope. did the Great Expectations movie, which I actually really liked a lot. Um, oh, I think right, that was right, the one right. with Ethan Hawke and Gwyneth Paltrow. Okay. Yeah. So this guy's been making movies for a couple yeah, decades yeah. now. Yeah. He's, he's, he makes great interesting. movies. I haven't seen I never it, but watched I want it. to so I think bad. someone tell me it's very, it I, I think, I think it'd odd. be a good, it's a whole different thing, but it's set in Mexico, and, and so I think it's, he's, I th- it looks like he's dealing with some of the same things that he talks about in that movie. Okay. And I think it just has to do with Mexico history. What mm-hmm. I'm what I'm noticing, yeah, he's talking about Iti Mama. Yeah, um, yeah. What I'm noticing is that he does like kind of these big grandiose stories. Yeah. I don't think he's. Well, uh, that's where like so like Iti Mama Tambien is different in that aspect. Oh, because gotcha, it is gotcha. More intimate and it's more you mm-hmm. know very intimate. And I think it, and that one is actually Spanish language. Okay. I don't think any of these other ones are. Maybe I've seen it. Can you like tell me the plot a little bit more of that it's one? The two is Gael Garcia Bernal and Diego Luna. Oh. Yes. Or the, the homies, I've heard so many good things about it, and, and I haven't and watched it. They pick it. her up, and yeah, it's, it's really his good. His cousin's wife, something, something like that. Yeah, mm. wow, that yeah. no, it's good. It's, it's so good. This piqued my interest a lot. Alfon- uh, what's this called again? Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 the movie that we're oh, watching. The movie that we just watched oh. the trailer for. Roma. 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 Yes. Roma. <laughs> Come on, it's right there. What are you talking about? <laughs> the thing we're supposed to be talking about. <laughs> Damn it! Right, right, right. Sorry. Yeah, no, I like it. Well, I saw shades of that. There's this in movie there. in that, so I'm 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 interested in the, uh, like I said, I mean just the 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 images Visuals. were really very very yeah the very cinematography beautiful, is stark. gorgeous yeah. trailers yeah. like this make me mad though because had we not googled it we yeah. wouldn't no. have known I actually had a feeling I was like this is going to be like Florida Project this is going to be like uh, like like Sicario without the plot line you sure. know yeah. things like that I had yeah. a feeling that that's what it was and but it, d- again, it is saying it's gonna follow the 70s family, so. right. like my favorite <laughs> one of my favorite time periods um even though there were a lot in of america awful, or well, no 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 <laughs> just like just like the fashion wise the, the clothing <laughs> and the music um just like the culture mm. around the 70s was really cool um but i think there were also a lot of terrible things happening in terms sure. of like political stuff during the 70s and so. he might yeah. he might show both sides of that it's yeah. i think he's going to yeah, yeah. Guess. yeah. let's watch this i'm, in, I'm interested yeah. let's yeah, watch yeah. it everybody watch, watch it. it sure watch Required it viewing. like i'll, I'll go <laughs> based on everyone. the director like yeah. I'll, he's one of those guys i'll yeah. just watch whatever he puts enough. out yeah would yeah. you say that it's a <laughs> i i hope so <laughs> I, I i will go into it ex- <laughs> hoping, hoping yeah, expecting I, spicy tones. Tones. I wanted, spicy I wanted to, yeah. nice i'm expecting we call it esperanza to show up in espanol so. Yes. All right, let's move on to our next trailer. The next trailer is $1, One Dollar, which is a uh, new CBS All Access original. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, uh, what's the problem? Hours have to be cut. Hours are money. Bringing money into a place makes that place better. We love having a little carry here. Logic. It is next week. I want what you owe me. At least let me take you out on a real date before you break my heart. Some days I think this place is about to die. Other days I think something is really about to happen here. Here you go. Are you serious? He's not homeless. Kid lives over on Maple. Oh my god, I am so sorry. <laughs> oh my god. It's awful. <laughs> what the Jesus? What is it? Some kind of murder at the mill. Right. No guns, no body. Got something special. You want me to shut down the mill? Cops are unpopular enough without taking bread out of people's mouths. It brings me to the storm. This thing, it won't cost none of a penny. Promise you that. I'm a detective, that's all I am. Even if I wasn't working a case, I'd still want to know what was what. None of this gets chased back to us, right? Insulted you to even ask. I have okay on taking sides in some white man tough war. <laughs> more information from the lab it appears that there are seven different kinds of blood from seven different people Ooh. oh damn huh. wow okay. un dolore 
So what is um, CBS All Access? Uh, it is, is their, their version streaming? of streaming. 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 Yeah, it's their Netflix. So, it was, uh, I think it launched with Star Trek Discovery. Yeah. So that was their big win. Oh, okay. Uh, for and, so, are, and, is, yeah. so is it, is this only going to be on that, or is yes. it going to be on the on the? It's not going to be on the, the network at all. No. I don't think so. It doesn't. Well, I was going to say. I, I wonder if because it doesn't look like a network show to me. Yes, yeah, no. it's set to premiere at CBS all on CBS All Access August thirtieth. It, does, it so looks does, very Fargo and True Detective. Yeah, you sure. know, better Twin Peaks. Do you think? Uh, yeah. Do you think it's so? Are are they? Is that so? There's no like ratings and. Uh, no, practices we mean, like why they would release an all access. Well, no, I think it's like a reason just, for them to get more people to, just to yeah. yeah. But I, well, to I, I guess I, I guess mean in 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 this like is this more like a would this be like a Netflix like Orange is the New Black? Probably. You know? Oh sure. Yeah yeah. Whereas they so they're not because Orange is the New Black would not play. Oh, at no. all oh, on like no. a network TV. Oh, oh no. interesting. See, that's what I mean. I wondered if, oh. if they put it on their on their streaming so they can have more. Freedom? You know, content, free, sure. freedom God, for storytelling, things like that. So you're saying I should I stop mean, cutting you off so I can I don't understand know. what you're it saying. Looks, <laughs> it looks good. I mean, it does look pretty interesting. I am not going to get CBS All Access yeah. because I don't feel like there are enough. There's enough content that I want to watch just to buy that. But um, if it eventually comes out, like just on some other service it's not going to it's not going to there's no way they're going to release it to hulu or netflix if there's some way to get a hold of it there's always a way (laughs) (laughs) right when there's a will we don't want to uh yeah they're they're, this is their this is their you know we're we're this is how we get people to subscribe right yeah Yeah. um i think that like i'm gonna skip only because it's on cbs all access if it wasn't i would watch it yeah it was just on tv and i was bored right yeah it's cool Yeah. yeah no i that's it's the a, a television show, one television show is enough for me to like, sell, uh, you know, sign off on the whole, on yeah. the whole service. It's, it's nice. directed it's by Craig films. Zobel, who did uh, the films Compliance, Great World of Sound, and then he co-founded Homestar Runner. Oh, nice! Oh, wow, right that's on. weird. The How heck? interesting. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I used that's to watch that when I was younger. Right. St- I, yeah, I yeah. still kind of watch those. <laughs> they still make them. Yeah, those little. Those I don't little know. Videos. Well, there, there. You can watch all the cartoons on YouTube now. Gotcha. So yeah, because it was its I, own I, website. It was right? a, I think the website's still up though. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, that one's uh, Yeah, because I've I've shown all this to my son. Very interesting. Uh, John Carroll Lynch, yeah. who uh, I most recently watched him in no Channel House, Zero, Channel No Zero. End House, season yeah. two, or he's season three. He's creepy as hell in that. Yeah. Um, um, he's in uh, the Drew Carey show. Yeah, he's a funny guy. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I yeah, I mean. If it, again, if it wasn't on guy. CBS All Access, I would watch it. But if it was a show, I, yeah, if it was on network, I'd be interested to see kind of the difference, I guess. Yeah. I, I, like, like I said, I'm, I'm intrigued just by, is it doesn't look like an like a TV show, like how, right. you know, like how they usually go. And I just wonder if they're, if they're taking that, mm-hmm. that sort of <laughs> line with it. One <laughs> of the wives from Black Klansman, the clan, the clan wife. Is, was that um, her is in this that's what i thought i recognized her mm-hmm. um she's a really good actress actually yeah she really made me hate her in black she, clansman oh so <laughs> i mean she did her so job much. right you she, know? Did yeah. her jo- she did her Oof. job Oof. um Oof. uh what was i going to say i don't remember so never mind sorry, sorry. <laughs> I yeah. cut you off. it's okay it's okay um yeah this one is a uh, oh oh that's what i was gonna say is that i was surprised at like how much traction this trailer was getting it got more views than most trailers this week i think maybe even than all of them it th- i mean it looks it does look really good like, like I, I can't i can't say that that it you know i'm like oh because most of the time I'm like, eh. does it look a little generic to you guys sure it yeah. looks like a tv sure. series but i mean sure. it's cbs that's kind of what we're it looks like yeah. if you loved fargo you would be super hyped yes yeah. mm. right which Except i do love me some fargo fargo but, is but here's the thing <laughs> fargo is hysterical <laughs> they have that on their side yeah on top of a really good story yeah. right uh, this doesn't have the funnies. Yeah. It doesn't look like. Doesn't look that'd be funny if it, was a, if it was a sitcom and they just like <laughs> didn't know like how to make a trailer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, so That'd we're all going to probably skip this, right? Because none of us are going to get the CBS. All That's access actually the channel. real reason. Yeah. 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 I mean, Honestly, it doesn't have to do. Yeah, it doesn't have to do with the actual show. Yeah. It's just that I'm probably. It was on gonna, Netflix yeah. and I was bored. Right. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Totally. Yeah. I'd do it. Yeah. Me too. Me too. Yeah. What do you guys think? You watching one dollar? That's to the audience. Uh, not you, producers. It's no. not always about you. <laughs> no. I know you make it. I know you think it is. 
All right. All right. Now we're watching. All right. Let's uh, let's else. watch uh, the nun. The nun. Oh no, I'm scared. I'm like already scared. Ah, Jesus. <laughs> Beautiful. Sorry. All right, that was it. Short and sweet. Uh, that was actually... That was no. it? That was it. That was, it. That was literally... You guys I, want to rewatch it? God damn it. Great advertising. No, 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 make me do it. It's not even push live. Yeah, you got to push that. You can do it, Jessica. <laughs> <laughs> That's the take we'll do. <laughs> Not the first one. That was great. Uh, uh, there's it. actually some controversy behind this. It was actually removed from YouTube. Oh, um, what? Because uh, it was showing up in ads uh -huh. for like regular YouTube shit. Like, <laughs> just other oh. things on YouTube. <laughs> it was yeah. scaring the <laughs> shit out of people. <laughs> old, old, ten old women I'm died. Sorry, but no, the, I'm nice. <laughs> <laughs> they all had a heart attack or something. That's hilarious, though. Oh, my yeah. God. It is frightening. Oh, shit. So they removed her from YouTube, and I think this is just some dude <sighs> re-uploaded it. Nice. Uh, the, it, it's <sighs> definitely got scared, that, uh, that, old, that uh, old internet. You know the yeah, yeah. Look, yeah. look at this I screen love and the that. That those commercial were so of that great. car. Do you remember the car driving down the road? I doubt. Yep. I doubt. Yep. Oh yeah, actually, yep. maybe. Yep. yep. And then it pops out. I only your... know because Dylan makes me watch all these things and doesn't tell me what they are. <laughs> I hate them. He doesn't tell me what they are, and then I want to kill him. Here's the thing, too. Like <laughs> so, I know there's a lot um, of like backlash. I don't know. I think it's people that don't appreciate horror films, to be honest with you, against jump scare films. Uh huh. But yeah, I, sure. I'm totally fine with jump scares. Sure. Uh, and these They're movies, fun. the Conjuring series, are so good. Yeah. Um, they are. And if, like, you think about it too, the other movies that are not so much focused on that, like the most recent one, uh, Her 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 Hereditary. I always want to say yeah. Heritage. Harry Potter. Is it Heritage? Uh, no, Hereditary. <laughs> It still has jump scares. It has jump scares. Oh my god! Effective it's jump scares. So yeah. it's very it scared the, I almost pissed my pants yeah. several times. But it is clearly separating itself from other horror films. Yeah. I think. I think. Th I think the. I think the the ones that catch all the flack are the ones that just rely almost solely on jump scares. Sure. Right. All their scares are jump scares. Sure. Sure. Like, eh. just costume jump scares. Mm. Yeah. I think a quiet place had best use of jump scares I've ever seen. Mm. I'm trying to remember like what what parts were that jumpy well, scary i think it, it had to do with just everybody being quiet it was just so quiet literally yeah. just like yeah. a the tap contrast. and you would be like the and sound then design of that film was contrast. insane oh my god yeah and then as soon as the spider came on screen you knew it was there and then the jump scare of like just a pin drop that was oh my but goodness yeah, that was really yeah. great that was yeah. a great, a great use of jump scare holy cow um yeah. all right so that was that let's uh do a little Not switchy outie me. um with oh uh, yeah are, we, are you guys gonna watch the nun i'm gonna go watch the nun because i want to get scared yeah, I love yeah. the Conjuring. It's part of the Conjuring series. It's a prequel. <laughs> um, I am absolutely I watching. Again. It looks like I some trash yeah. Rego to make me watch when we're bored. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Do you have you seen the Conjuring or? I did. I liked the con. That was you one set in the seventies, right? Yeah. yeah. You know, I it's ask you the seventies <laughs> expert. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay, you, if, you, if it's one. in the seventies, you know it. It's the <laughs> same um, universe. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like. It. Um, I'm not yeah. crazy about the Annabelles though. I'm not. Yeah. The same universe. I like Annabelles. Kill it. I'm the same way. I like the Conjuring. If it's I'll like The Conjuring, I'll see it. Yeah. Well, I mean, at, I, I, I don't know what it's, it's going to be more like. It's more likely going to be like, like Annabelle. Annabelle. But, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. yeah, it's hard to say. That's what I mean. I enjoy The Conjuring. This is like two. Is this like, there's a third one, isn't there? Or is there is the third one out? is coming out, oh, okay. but it's going to be a while. Because right. I think there's another movie after The Nun that's going to be a sequel. And then The Conjuring will be the most. There's a huge timeline. Yeah. It's like 30 years of yeah. this. It's yeah. a Marvel Universe. I did, it's Marvel yeah. uni but, but with but horror. When do you see that in horror? That's no, why that's, it's that's partially true. exciting for me. Well, I'm, it's based I, I on these like real the idea, people, yeah. right? That were like real yeah. Paranormal yeah, yeah, paranormal investigators. investigators. Real yeah, investigators. Exactly. Yeah, I look, like I said, I, yeah. I, I did, I did dig the Conjuring movies, uh, but cool. I just haven't yeah. really, I haven't really got into the whole. You know, what's funny is that the first yeah. Annabelle didn't do well, but the second one people second really one liked killed, it. Yeah, yeah, the second one killed. Yeah. So didn't feel it. Yeah, I'm not yeah. a horror person. No, you're not. No. I'm very picky. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. But yeah. the horror I like, I I'm like. not picky with horror movies. Like if they make me scared, which it's as you can tell, it's very not very hard to make me scared. And you were expecting it. <laughs> yeah. Um, if you guys want to like watch that again, he actually has like many videos where he <laughs> pops out and scares me. There should just be a whole YouTube channel dedicated to me doing embarrassing things because <laughs> I do a lot of them. Oh. But um, maybe maybe sometime later. Yeah. We'll do that for mm -hmm. Color Circuit. Yeah. Or It'll be a whole separate embarrassing, channel. Uh, embarrassing Jessica videos. You should um, do it for yeah. April 1st. 
Yeah. Oh, release, release uh, a wide yes. release. Yeah. Nice. It'll be great. Nice day. We'll yeah. do it at the guild. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I had so much embarrassment in my life. I'm just okay with it now. So I feel sure. it. It's fine. I feel it. Anyway, uh, let's watch. All right. Yeah. Let's get <laughs> uh, Jessica trailer. to switch out with uh, Connor. This is actually going to be our last trailer of okay, the day. Cool. So thank you very much, Jessica. You're kicking me out. Kicking you out. <laughs> no. I'm but just we, kidding. I don't know do anything about you. One Punch Man. So here you go, Connor. Yeah. 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 There you go. Here's Mr. <laughs> Connor. Welcome. Welcome. Oops. Uh, this is the trailer for season two special announcement, One Punch Man. Cool. Um, of which you could tell I'm a big old fan. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Huge. Um, I'm just happy I get to sit next to Dylan. Yeah. I'm going to one punch Aww. you. I'm <laughs> <laughs> just been coming Whoa. After, you've just been coming after me all day. I have, Aww. I know. Yeah, well, sometimes you need to be grounded a are, little are bit. Are you mad at me? No, Aww. I love you. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh it's, and this is the team. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Dream yeah. team. Dream team. Yeah, yeah. Can't wait to take hey. on Smell and Wes. Smell and Wes. Smell and Wes. The good, good trash talk. Let's watch uh, <laughs> One Punch Man Season 2 special announcement. Yeah. を執行 <laughs> Just stells. Is that April? Yeah, that's April. <laughs> Nice. Wow. Nice. That's how you make a Japanese trailer. Oh, yeah. I'm there already you. excited for it. <laughs> My favorite was when they were showing the words, and one of them said, super sideways jump or something like that. <laughs> um, uh, so, yeah, for those of you, I mean, if you're not watching this, unless you like One Punch Man, obviously, but if you don't understand, it's a very basic premise, and it is a guy that is too strong. Yeah. He right. is the ultimate, like, like, like he, he would be on those lists of like who's the who's the strongest superhero he, he can kill he you would be uh, uh, yeah he would Basically. be the, yeah. the, the superhero to win not two yeah. punch man uh, no. one no. punch man yeah i don't not, know i don't know how one it punch would... in like a little shove yeah <laughs> not, <laughs> not, not one and a half punch yeah no and kick. it makes you wonder like how do you make a whole show off of a person who just demolishes anything he goes that he I, comes up against ask dragon that's ball that's like Z. the whole point yeah yeah, yeah right have you ever watched anime that's that's most anime fighting anime Right, right, yeah. yeah. So, sure. how is he against Super Saiyan Goku? Uh, I f he'd probably win. He'd probably, yeah. he'd probably yeah. win. Saitama. Yeah. I well, I mean, name, right? although at the same time, I mean, the Saiyans are like Swiss Army knife right. powerful, where it's just they just keep on. It's like how okay, he's already super powerful. He can't get any more powerful. Oh wait, there's this there's this other version of Saiyans. Right. right. So yeah. he can get even more powerful. There you go. Haha, <laughs> we win. <laughs> right. Uh, so so we'll probably see One Punch Saiyan form at some point. There you go. That would Confuse be awesome. with mm -hmm. him to become the one punch <laughs> saying. Right. Anime is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, I'm actually not like huge, huge on anime. Like I certainly watch I some. Um, like you're not familiar with Cowboy Bebop and my mind exploded. Yeah, I've watched yeah. like like a little bit. Yeah. But like I don't, I haven't, I couldn't finish Akira. And I know that's like everybody's Ooh. favorite. It's so good. I know. I don't know what's wrong with uh, me, man. It doesn't. My 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 Japanese you know mother didn't, it? didn't st stick in my. Well, I'm half Japanese. So. Yeah, yeah, I got you. <laughs> See, as a white guy, it's but Akira. I fell in love so hard with One Punch Man. Mm -hmm. um, One Punch Man. It's, it's awesome. And uh, it largely because it, it's so tongue in cheek. Yeah, and um, yeah. it's so uh, it's very glib, if you will. <laughs> um, and uh, they do a very good job, and like I, I know enough about uh, anime to know that like they're doing a ton of mixing mm, yeah. of genre, 
um, I, I, within anime. A lot of animes, like Space Dandy, did that. Like they'll do different like uh, styles of anime yeah. and stuff like that. Just as within o- like s- the same shots and mm-hmm. episodes, as like were- homages to which, which is just another reason to get into anime because sure. it's it's such a celebration of itself. <laughs> right, uh-huh. right, right. Yeah, it's like Hollywood always makes films about Hollywood. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, like I just there's such an artistic form to anime that. I feel like it deserves that. Sure, sure. Yeah. Uh, and and in this way, also, like it's it's not just in love with itself; it's making fun of itself oh, yeah, too. Yeah. yeah, which is one of the reasons I like One Punch Man. Yeah, because because anime is so larger than life and like isn't way too over the top for most. I, I thought it wasn't that like part of the point of One Punch Man yes. anyway. I mean, they're they're like specifically like they're pointing uh, it out. Yeah. Yeah. how insane yeah. it is. Yeah, I, I, I dig that as well. I mean, I, yeah. like I said, I I didn't get it. I. I think I saw an episode or something at a mm-hmm. friend's house. I was like, oh, okay. And, you know, I was just and I started watching it. I was like, yeah, it was pretty good. You Above know? all else, honestly, it's the humor that gets me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's so fucking funny. Like, I, I mean, I love One Punch Man because it's nice to have a, a newer anime that's a popular because mm-hmm. right. you don't you don't really see that anymore where with anime taking over in pop culture you don't really see any new animes do that unless it's attack on titan right and attack yeah, on yeah. titan is such a miserable show to watch <laughs> it's like it's such a downer i had to stop watching yeah. it, it's it's I almost know, I love it, it's but still yeah no i get it it's it's great but it's borderline unwatchable with sure. how unhappy of a show it is yeah I'm so it's nice things. to have an anime like one punch man that is hilarious and doesn't take itself too seriously. It's great that like Fooly Cooly's back and and Fooly Cooly is is it, is it back back? It or it it got re- well the the second season it, just yeah. ended and I think the third season is about to begin. Okay, and if you've never watched Fooly Cooly, right, right. it's incredible. I know. I've got the shirt FLCL. Mm. Yeah. It's weird. No, that's that. Yeah, that's like that's the that to me that's like the the weird anime. That's like yeah, watch that. So <laughs> cool. yeah. it's amazing. Um, the one another one I think of that like doesn't take itself too seriously is the Netflix ori- Agritsuko, the Netflix mm-hmm. original. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's a panda. It the red. It's a red panda. It's it's <laughs> fucking awesome. It is such a good show. And again, though, I think maybe it's just that I tend towards the comedy ones. But it's right. very yeah. Comedic. Well, I, I get funny. I get you. Like the I I don't really other than maybe like Trigun and Cowboy Bebop um, I don't really watch like very serious anime mm, because right. it just it just it just feels like it takes forever to watch sure yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that's why they made the condensed version of Dragon Ball right right <laughs> yeah well Dragon Ball I, I mean I could like I could watch it. Dragon Ball forever <laughs> I like the Dragon Ball Z thing. I get a little bit but like Dragon Ball that, yeah. that's are my you talking shit. OG like baby the OG okay, Dragon baby. Ball you're yeah. the only person who says Dragon that Dragon Ball's ball. way better yeah. Dragon Ball's so good they talk yeah. so much shit to me but I just just can I even mention Pokemon I feel like that doesn't count anymore I mean is Pokemon anime yeah I know it's anime but it doesn't count does it count? It's the best. You can mention it, but everybody knows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's, know, it's know. like Digi- everybody it's, knows. Like you're a poser. It's like know. Digimon's no. my favorite anime. Get out of this. <laughs> oh. Just because the Japanese animated it, get out of here. <laughs> that doesn't count. That shouldn't be on your list. Like Avatar is my favorite. That's a, anime. No, that, that's not anime. It's that's my not favorite anime. Favorite anime. I know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, speaking of, also Dragon Prince. Uh, if you oh, yeah. if you like um, if you like Avatar, the the the, the same 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 group of people went off and made a Netflix original Dragon Prince which I think drops next month mm. next nice. month Ooh, can that yeah. be required viewing oh yeah it's gonna be required viewing oh, 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 yeah. I, I don't care whose um, turn it is it's my turn when I, I cannot on. wait for April what's going on April uh, One Punch Man season oh, 2 hey! Hey! Yeah, way to bring it around I never That's actually got into host. this show. thank you <laughs> Uh, yes, one punch. Oh, so yeah. Anything else on like on the trailer that you really picked up on? It just seemed like it was a teaser trailer, just saying, "Hey guys, yep. one punch, uh, one punch man two's coming back in April." <laughs> yeah, I mean, just, uh, it's get hyped. Yeah, the yeah. more I get, yeah. the more I get into anime, and the more like I get into like Japanese wrestling and stuff like that. I feel like I start to kind of start to really get what Japanese culture is about. Yeah, like American. It's very different than American. Culture. It's, yeah. it's it's more like. It's just a form of respect. Like, American trailers are going to spoon feed you all the stuff you need sure. to know. Japanese trailers are more just like, you know what it is. Mm, gotcha, gotcha. This mm. isn't like, you don't need to be teased with story or plot. It's just like, you need to be hyped. Yeah. 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 yeah and Japanese it's, are almost always hyped. It's the hip hop of trailer making. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's the, yeah. It's, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. the Ryan Lewis to uh, anime's Macklemore. Ugh, that felt <laughs> gross. <laughs> I felt gross. I didn't, I didn't like, like it. Yeah, I didn't like it. Come here I, didn't, I didn't want to say it, but Put I, it back in. I, 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 I don't know. I thought it was funny. <laughs> Macklemore's terrible. 
Um, sweet. So are you going to watch One Punch Man season two? I'm sure you are. Otherwise, you wouldn't be watching this. Uh, <laughs> did you like the trailer? That's another good question. What other questions do you guys have for our viewers? Uh, um, what are you are wearing? Guys, yeah. How are you guys doing? Yeah. How are good? you doing? Is what this, is this yeah. weird? Is it weird? Is it weird? Do you wear like weird? kitchen gloves when you go out and invite people? Well, yeah. Uh, what else are you gonna wear? I, well, yeah. I don't know. I got I called know. one punch man when I was bald. I, we were doing burnt bagel, and someone was like, "It's one punch man." I'm like, "Why?" Because I'm <laughs> bald. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any hair? God, I forgot you were. You had so many different hairstyles. I like to good. keep everybody guessing. You do. You keep me on my toes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 A I'm a I'm a timeline of colors. This is a bum stage. Uh, anyways, this has been Screen Source Jr., your place for film and television news reviews and trailers, specifically the trailers here. Uh, but if you want to see full episodes of Screen Source where we talk about um, film and television news, uh, amongst other things, you can catch it right here on that subscribe button on the channel. It'll be everywhere. Maybe I'll even put up a little thing right here that you can click on. Yeah, yeah. I, like, I want it to like, like be right here. Um, cool. Yeah, yeah. We could do it. It's not too difficult. I believe in you. Yeah, you believe sure. in me. Um, what else? Oh, catch us every day live on our Twitch channel. What kind of show do you do? Uh, I run a baking show. Okay. Aww. Called Sit Down and Bake Cakes. Sit Down and Bake Cakes. No, no, no. no. It's, it's uh, the best wrestling podcast on Color Circuit because it's the only wrestling podcast on Color Circuit. Yep, yep. Sit Down and Pile Drive live every Monday on twitch.tv slash Color Circuit Live. 7 p.m. Mountain Sit Time. What else are you doing this weekend, Lexi? We are going to be performing live, Connor and I, at the box in downtown Albuquerque at seven thirty. Yeah, oh. seven thirty. Uh -huh. And Phil, Phil and Wes, <laughs> I hope you brought diapers because you're going to shit your pants when you get called out in second place <laughs> as we take home the trophy. You got nothing. You got nothing, Phil. You got nothing, Wes. I like Wes. I don't want to call it Wes. I, like I just Wes. feel bad. He's so nice. He's really cool. He, I'm like, like he should just drop that dead weight, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that's what it's like yeah. here at Color Circuit. Uh, we have a ton of fun, um, and we will. Oh, my name is Dylan. Stanley. Lexi. Connor, and I. Phil. Phil's great. Phil's great. Uh, Jessica like was him. on screen before too. Um, we will see you next time. Miss you. Love you. Bye. Thank you, producer. Bye. <laughs> I was gonna say that's not really long. Am I yeah. crazy? Oh man.